Okay, hello kids. Today we are going to continue with the story Coyote and the Fire Quest. Okay, so remember this is a story about a coyote looking for fire for the furless people. Okay, ¿se acuerdan que en esta historia el coyote busca mantener caliente a la gente sin, sin pelaje, verdad? Okay, so the coyote is looking to keep the furless people Warm by how? Give them the fire. ¿Qué le va a dar? Fuego. So we have the vocab for these two pages, okay? So we have the first word is argue. Argue. Argue means discutir, okay? So what means argue? Discutir. For example, when you argue, you have a problem. Cuando discuten es porque tienen un problema. The other word we have is grumble. Okay? Grumble. Quejarse. For example, when you don't like something, you grumble. Cuando no les gusta algo, ustedes se quejan. Grumble. The other two words we have, it is perfect. Perfect. What is perfect? Perfecto. Okay? God is perfect. The second word we have is worry. Worry. It means cansado. Okay? After school, you feel worried. Okay? Después de la escuela, ustedes se sienten cansado. Worry. The last two words we have for the uh, these two pages are streak. 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 It means rayo o luz. As you can see in the picture, you see like a light, okay? Ustedes ven como un rayo, una luz, okay? In, in that picture. The other word we have is swallow. 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 It means tragar. Okay, when you swallow your food, you swallow water, okay? Swallow. Okay, so we are going to continue reading the story. This part is on page 206, okay? So we have, Coyote sneak up the mountain. Okay, el coyote subió a la montaña. Two nights and days he hid watching the guards protect the fire. Dos noches y días se escondió vigilando a los protectores del fuego. While one kept watch, the other two slept in the teepee. Mientras uno cuidaba, los otros dos dormían en la tienda. After a few hours, one of them would hurry out to take the watcher's place. Después de unas cuantas horas, uno de ellos tomaba el lugar para seguir cuidando el fuego. But the guards were sleeping in the morning. It was hard to crawl out of a warm bed. Pero en la mañana los guardias estaban, tenían mucho sueño y entonces era muy, muy difícil que pudieran salir de la cama a seguir cuidando. Hurry up, the tired guard would shout at the sleeper. Que se apure, le gritaba uno el guardia que estaba cuidando a los demás. Then the weary guard would leave the fire and stomp over the teepee. Entonces el, el guardia que estaba cansado dejaba el fuego y se iba a dormir. While the guard started to argue, fire burned by itself. Mientras el fuego... Se quemaba por sí solo. Los guardias peleaban o discutían entre ellos. Perfect, said Coyote, racing down the mountain. Entonces fue cuando ahí el Coyote dijo que es perfecto ese momento. Okay? So we have that the Coyote sneaked to the mountain to see the guards. Para ver qué pasaba, ok? So the question is, where do the guard, fire guards sleep? ¿Dónde duermen los guardias del fuego? In a house, in a teepee, or in a tent? Okay, continuing with the stories on the same page 206. Before dawn, Coyote returned. 
antes del amanecer, dawn means amanecer. Coyote returned, o sea, regresó el coyote. The other animals waited at the bottom. Los otros animales esperaron abajo. At dawn, as the guards began to grumble one another, Coyote leaped. Al amanecer, cuando los guardias empezaron a, a discutir, a pelear entre ellos, el coyote saltó. He grabbed a glowing coal and took off. Entonces, él agarró un carbón que estaba brillante y salió. But at the bottom of the mountain, the guards caught up. Pero al final de la montaña, los guardias pudieron atraparlo. When they grabbed his tail, the tip turned white. Entonces, cuando los guardias agarraron la, la cola del, sol, del coyote, la punta se volvió blanca. And coyote tails have been that way ever since. Okay, so that's, they say that because of the guards touched the tail, then um, that's why the coyote has the white tail, ¿ok? Entonces ellos dicen que porque los guardias del fuego tocaron la punta de la cola del, del coyote, por eso es que es blanca. Then white coyote threw the coil to the squirrel. The squirrel took off carrying the coal on her back. Entonces el coyote muy sabiamente le tiró el carbón a la ardilla, ¿ok? Y la ardilla salió corriendo con el carbón en su espalda. How the coal burned as she fled through the treetop. Entonces el carbón quemaba eh, a, cuando ella estaba huyendo. Ever since the tail of girl have curled over their backs. Entonces dicen que, por, que el carbón está en su espalda, por eso la cola de la ardilla es, es como enrolladita. Okay? So we have the question. What were the animals passing to each other? ¿Qué se estaban pasando los animales uno a otro? The coal, the marker, or what else? Okay, so this part is on page 206. So I'm going to continue reading. You pay attention, please, and try to, try, uh, try to practice reading too. So we have. The guards leap after Squirrel, and just as they attack Squirrel, through the coal. Ok, entonces los guardias saltaron sobre el Squirrel, la ardilla, y pues, so, cuando ellos atacaron, Squirrel threw the coal, entonces tiró el carbón. It made a bright streak through the sky as Chipmunk jumped up to catch it. Ok. Hizo un, una luz en, en, a través del, del cielo y Chimon saltó para agarrarlo. The guards were right behind. Los guardias estaban justo atrás. Chimon got away, but not before a guard's claw struck her. Pero no antes de que un guardia con sus garras ata, el, el, el rasguñara a Chipmunk. That's why chipmunks have three marks on their backs to this day. Entonces ellos dicen que por eso los chipmunks tienen tres rayas atrás en su espalda. Then chipmunk threw the coal to frog. Después chipmunk tiró el carbón al frog. But as frog leaped away, the guards reached up and cut his tail. Entonces, pero en lo que, la, en lo que el frog trataba de huir, los guards le agarraron la cola, ¿ok? At the last minute, he tossed the coal to wood and escaped. Al último minuto le tiró el carbón a wood. Wood, ¿se acuerdan que es el árbol? And escaped, y escapó. But he lost his tail to the guards. And today, frogs still have no tails. Entonces dicen de que... Frog perdió la, la cola por los guardias y por eso es que los frogs no tienen cola. So the question is, who lost his tail? Ok. Who lost his tail? ¿Quién perdió la cola? Frog, chicken, squirrel. ¿Quién la perdió? Ok. So the last part of the story. The coal flew toward wood. 
would open his knot hole and wide and go. Entonces el árbol would, ok, el carbón voló y entonces would abrió un hoyo que tenían en el árbol y, se, y entonces ahí metió el carbón. Was able to swallow that coal. Y entonces se tragó ese carbón. Remember, swallow means tragar. He would not give up. The guards twisted and tore at him, but he would not let go. Finally, they got, gave up and slinked back up to the mountain. Los guardias trataron de quitarle el carbón a Wood, pero Wood no se dejó, entonces se rindieron y los guardias regresaron a la montaña. Good work, said Coyote. Now we must give the fire to the furthest one. Buen trabajo. Ahora debemos de darle el fuego a las personas sin pele, pela, pelaje. Wood was only too happy to give up the fire. It burned his belly, but giving it up was not easy. Rubbing two sticks together released the fire. Ok, entonces Wood estaba feliz de dar, de dar el fuego. Le estaba quemando su estómago. But giving up, it was not easy. Entonces para, para entregar el fuego... Con dos palitos, entonces empezaron a, a frotar los dos. Hooray, shouted the furless people when Coyote showed them this trick. As they warmed themselves, they said, now we will never be cold again. Ok, entonces eh, las personas estaban felices porque ya no iban a pasar frío because of the fire. So the question is, who gave the fire to the furless people? ¿Quién le dio el fuego a los furless people? Coyote, eh, the guard, who gave to them. So we finished the story, okay? So eh, now you have to answer the questions, okay? That we have on this video and you have to send them on and more. Entonces terminamos la historia, contesten las preguntas siguiendo las que tienen anteriormente 